We're late, we're late. Go, go, this go. This school doesn't care. I care. Try it again. I can't. Cody, you can do it. Come on. I don't get it, Mom. I can't wait. With 10,000 studies about how being poor affects education, I can tell you being poor sucks and my kid can't read. So, Miss Activist, Jamie was the perfect role for you. Um, God, I mean, she's way more of a hero than me. And at the same time, I don't think she thinks of herself as an activist. Certainly not in the beginning of the movie, right? I mean, I don't think she thinks of herself as political or intellectual or an activist at all. And then she ends up getting activated by her heart. We need to fix Adams, and we need to do it yesterday. Right? We need to fix Adams, and we need to do it yesterday. She's not afraid. Have you ever been afraid? Yes. She is not afraid, it's true, in a way that's kind of shocking. In a way that when I was looking at the part, I kind of thought, it's only like a teenager who's not afraid like that, mm -hmm. thinks like, I'm gonna change the world. You know? Invincible. But I played her kind of like a teenager mm -hmm. because of that. Like I wanted her to kind of look like a teenager, act like a teenager. Yeah. You know? It seems that she has no family support. However, you come from a very large family, famous family, and you know now you're married, you have children. Um, what kind of influence has that had on your child rearing versus Jamie? Yeah, I mean, first of all, she's a single mom, which, to be honest, I find difficult to even imagine. I have a good friend who's a single mom with a daughter about the same age as, as my daughter, my older daughter, and I just can't even imagine. I remember when I was making Crazy Heart, I had a 20-year-old babysitter, and I thought that was gonna be fine, and my husband was away for a few weeks, and I, I just called my mom and said, I need you, can you come and help me? And she was on the next plane, you know? I mean, Jamie doesn't have anything like that. How was it working with Viola and Daniel? And Viola is such a powerful force, you know? And um, I think that we're very different, but I don't know, somehow we kind of like fit together, you know? Very, I would throw things at her and, she would send them back to me, not at all how I anticipated, which is like kind of always what you want. So I was always awake when I was acting with her. And Daniel? And Daniel's great. He's really smart and I think really likes actors, wants actors to soar in his movie. And I think that, that this issue is very important to him. Yeah, it definitely is for all of us. Yeah. Right. Have you heard about those mothers that lift one-ton trucks off their babies? They're nothing compared to me.